I like what I do before I, and then I went for it. Yeah. Yes, I have more than 20 workers for the painting. Wow, 20. Wow. Yeah, more than. More I know than. <laughs> Let's just say life is not fair. Uh, what I'm trying to say is that sometimes you'll be working from the inside. Nobody will know the effort that you are putting. If some people see me on the road, they'll be like, hey, this guy's here, this guy's here, this guy's here, okay. But they will not know the, 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 the stress that you are undergoing from the inside. When some people see you spending your money, they'll be like, ah, who knows the man that gave her that money, this or that, you know? That's the mentality people have about young girls. Hello guys, welcome back to another one. So today we are in Newe and we are bringing you another Newe business. Why in Newe in business? So we, today we are with this young lady, you know, she's an entrepreneur. She does a lot of things. We have come to show you what she does and ask her a few questions about what she do. Just stay tuned and don't go anywhere. Well, my name is Judith Chukulobe. I'm a paint producer and I also do painting service both for emotion paints, test coat paints, satin paints, and other kinds of paints you, you know, gravitas paint. We also do stucco apply application service. Yeah, those are what I do. That's really interesting, but could you just tell us, like, how did you start all this? <laughs> well, it's a long story, Sha, but I started with what I think I like what I do. Before I, and then I went for it. Yes, that's what I would say it's all about. Okay. I what I like. Okay, what you like? That's your passion. Yes, I like to do that. Okay. Name of my brand is Beyond Vast Limited. That's the name of my registered business. But my brand is Beyond Vast Paint and Painting Service. Okay. Do you do, you do all kinds of paints? Yes, I produce all kinds of paints apart from stucco. Because stucco is an important kind of paint. Yeah. Well, this one I'm doing now, I have a paint. I have a place that I'm painting now. Okay, you're also a painter. Yes, I'm also a wow. painter. Wow. So, but I have workers that we also do. I also do painting with. So I'm taking this ones now to Omonia. Okay, from Nehu to Omonia. Yes, yes. Wow, that's quite interesting. That's you are, you are now getting job across the state or across the country. I, I ha I'm, not, I'm not gotten across the country, but I hope to, to get. Yes, but I've gotten in Abuja, Imo State, Anambra, you know, different parts of Nigeria, Asaba, different parts of Nigeria. So it depends on where I have to work. Then I'll have to call Moto to help me transport the paint down to that place. Yeah. Uh, but so many young girls out there would like to know, like, how did you get to learn this skill? How did you get to learn it? Like how, how long did it take you before you perfected on this your craft? You know, in any business, I don't really think that there is perfection. You can only be good enough, but not perfect. Yes, because in this my business, after learning, when I went to learn it, I kept on learning, then practicing. You get because I okay, I started learning from YouTube because when I went to learn it, the price they were telling me that I was going to pay was it was much. So I started learning from YouTube. After that, I looked for around a nearby place. Okay, I, I started going to Oka to learn from somebody in Oka. Then along the line, I felt like I think I'm, I'm good enough from here. Then I said, okay, let me go to Lagos. And I went to Lagos and I upgraded my, my business, yes, myself. So that's how, you know. Then after that, I still came back and I kept on watching on YouTube because there are some things that you will learn today. You might think you already know it, but you do not know that you have forgotten. But when you hear another person talking about it, you will you will recall and remember what maybe what your teacher taught you or what you have seen or yes, this or that. Exactly. Uh -huh. Then there are some things that a particular chemical now might have two functions. You might not know. Maybe your teacher told what well, the person that taught you told you so that you just he do, yes, he just he have he, he does this or he does that. Yes, but when you start watching on YouTube, I'm not saying that people that put videos on YouTube, they are saying the perfect or the correct thing. No, that's not what I'm trying to say. Just expand what, your yeah, knowledge. What I'm trying to say is that you will not just say because I, I went to learn. 
and they and i and i land for three months i paid for three months and after that three months you just close your your book that i've learned it all uh -huh. that's what i'm trying to say uh -huh. so i watch videos of different people and i'm still watching yes because i know that you might think you know something you might not know that there is another way of doing, doing it, it that I, that will give you a better result than but, what you already know so that's just what i would say i've been going so, so I, will not say, I will not say i learned it one month or two months or one year no that's it's not. been a continuous yes, process yes, okay. where i've learned this one yeah. you now try to upgrade yes yes that's nice so but how for how long have you been in this business now <laughs> well i've been in this business two years plus so two years plus yeah i will not say two years and six months and three days just okay. two more two years. so but how has been how has um the experience been for you my dear, sometimes it's sweet, sometimes it's rough, sometimes it's easy. Sometimes it's... Okay, to me, it's very interesting because I think this is what I love doing. I don't... I, I, I would do another... Anyway, I have another business that I'm doing. But I would do, I would do painting over and over again. Yes, because I think that it, it might be stressful, a kind of... Based on I'm a girl then and you also have um let me say i don't know how i'm going to put this in english now <laughs> but Just anyhow anyhow, you want yeah. to say it. but anyhow anyhow that anyhow there's every business has its own advantages and disadvantages, and disadvantages yes let me say um painting or paint production has its own disadvantage health wise okay yes but but the money is you know the it's attractive is, yes the money is attractive most especially if you are having work steady like if you are doing it continuously I mean, you know that yeah. as one in the so far there is money in it you don't even mind you know <laughs> but but considering the health the health um issues now but there are also gadgets you can use to protect yourself yes i have those gadgets i have my goggle glasses and my nose mask but the the, <laughs> the nose banks i use not just this um what's the name of not the that ebola um uh, not that coronavirus the paper one, the, um, no no um, not that one. one not that one but my own the hand one of the hand just slipped away so but, but i think you need to you know replace it all yes yes you know, I, so I, I i because that that nose mask i bought it from jumia but that's a chemical um kind of nose mask yes but no, I, I I didn't see it around, so I was looking for you know how I'm going to mend it and start making use of it again. So because it's expensive, it's not what I'll just go and buy again. Mm. So gradually, gradually, you you are going to replace it and even yeah, buy more. I'm, yeah, I'm going to buy more. I'm going to buy more, but it's as time goes on. Okay, yeah. okay. You you say that you're also a painter. Yes. Do you when you make paint? you paint for people do you charge differently for them for the for the two services <laughs> yes of course if you go to the market to buy paint won't you pay a painter you pay a painter but what i do is that i i make sure that i i okay money for my paint is, is let me say is slightly negotiable just very little i can just say maybe because of the quantity you are buying let me just remove five thousand Mm. Uh -huh. not as if i will remove up to 500 no uh -huh. but if you are go if i'm going to do the painting i can just charge you anything that you are willing to pay to pay yes because i'm going to produce the paint okay so you're going to show us around your your work now the paint you just produced let's see okay well i produced a yellow paint yesterday okay let me show you So this is the yellow paint. Because the person that the customer producing this paint for sale he needed yellow and ash. So this is the yellow paint. Okay, the other one is the ash. Yes, and this one. Okay, is let's the see, let's see. Okay, yeah. this is the. Wow. This is the one I produced yesterday, which is the yellow paint. Yes. So, like a bucket of paint now is like how much? <laughs> it doesn't have a fixed price, you know, because yeah. some. Some customers will tell you that they want a paint, a kind of paint that water is not going to leak, leak through. You have to add extra chemical into it. And some customers will tell you that they want a paint that 
the color will last for 10 years. There are some chemicals you add. You know, you know, all those things, they buy it, especially based on Nigeria economy, mm. because nothing is stable. Mm. So today you can buy chemical for, okay, today now it might cost you 12000 Maybe next, next tomorrow when you come, production will be costing 15000 So, you know, you know how Nigeria is now. Of course, of nothing course, of course. The economy is not stable. Nothing is to go there. Everything is going up, up, up. Okay, let's see the face of the ash. So, this is the ash. Ash, yeah. Okay, I think this one is a little bit So, okay, this wow. is the face of the ash. Oh. From the look, you even know that it's of high quality. <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be. So, it's more like you make like special quality paint. Yes, I make special quality paints. Like yes. your quality is more than those you find in the market. Yeah, definitely. Ah, definitely, definitely, definitely. Wow. Why? What is it economical mm. to you? Like, is it economical? Do you, you how know, do you make and um, gain? No, what I quality paint? yes, what I believe is um, what's that in himself? There is there is more advantage in quality than in in in, in just producing paint. Yeah. Yes, because if you produce a paint for somebody. Maybe one bucket for let me say twelve thousand naira now. I do not add enough materials that is going to make the paint to last. Some people will finish painting this year now. Maybe by next year, the the paint have already faded out. Faded. Yes, and the the paint have already started staining. You know, different complaints from different customers. So and that, those customers now will end up painting it again. And if the if you know how Nigeria is now, if you buy something, and it's not good for your for your brand. No, I don't do that kind of paint. Yes, I don't do that kind of paint. But those are the mistake I see people doing. Mm -hmm. Then I try to correct it in my own. Yes, to avoid like I can give you guarantee for five years, for ten years. Mm -hmm. It depends on what you tell what you told me that you want. Okay. Yes, some people will be there. Let me say the environment where they are staying. In. Maybe it might be a swampy area. You will not just use any kind of paint and come and paint it because you know water is going to spoil the paint. So there are some special chemicals they are going to add inside the paint to, let me say, help uh -huh, in the long lasting of the paint. Okay. So all those things, that's what I say that the price varies from what you want because I produce special paints, yes, for special problems. So this one to produce now, I met you here yesterday. Was it just a day job, like, like the production? Yeah, the production can... Uh, I can produce 100 buckets a day. In a day? Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. So, that means you must have enough manpower. <laughs> no. Like work for like workers. You have enough workers. To yes, I have I have workers for the paint production, for the painting. Yes, I have more than 20 workers for the painting. Wow, 20? Wow. I have more than. More I know than. <laughs> now, big woman, you be, oh. I'm not being good man because they will still collect all the money. <laughs> yeah, for, for you to have 20 workers, wow, will, that's that's impressive. They will collect the money for the painting. Yes, but the paint production now, you know, I used to stay in somebody's production site before. But, I, you know, I'm gradually putting up mine because me, I don't like beggy beggy something. Yeah, I used to pay. I used to pay when I was using somebody's factory. But, you know, having my own, is, is I think I... I prefer having my own than using you have your stuff. own peace of mind. Yeah. Do what you want do to do it, anytime. You want to do, do it. it. Exactly. Yes, because yesterday now when you met me, I started around after five for me to produce that um yellow yellow, yellow color. Yes, because I, I I had other activities that was taking my time. Yeah, so but I didn't even I was doing it in somebody else's factory. They used to close around four thirty. Then by five, they make sure that nobody is there. They'll just, you know, if you're a customer, they'll tell you 430, don't come again, no, because they'll be closing around five. So you imagine that kind of thing, whereby me, I'm having chance around that kind of five. So all those, let me say, inconveniences are what made me to decide to start putting up my own little by little. But, you okay. Know, you know, wow, you wow. You Your story is quite inspiring. Okay, Um, do you have any words for young girls out there? Well, mm, <laughs> let's just say life is not fair. And what I'm trying to say is that sometimes you'll be working from the inside. Nobody will know the effort that you are putting. Yes. Like for me now, some people, 
if some people see me on the road, they'll be like, hey, this guy's a wrong guy, this guy's a wrong guy. But they will not know the, 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 the stress that you are undergoing from the inside. When some people see you spending your money, they'll be like, ah, who knows the man that gave her that money, this or that, you know? That's the mentality people have about young girls. Yes, but for me, now, I just believe in doing what I, I, I think I have to do. Because no matter what you do, they will still talk. And they will never say the good thing. It's always the bad thing.